Tonight, big developments in plans to reopen businesses and end stay-at-home orders. In half an hour, Kansas Governor Laura Kelly will spell out, spell out her plan to end the state's order after May the 3rd. Details, though, have already leaked, and we'll have more on that in just a minute. Less than one hour ago, Wyandotte County extended its stay-at-home order until May the 11th. Earlier today, Johnson County did the, did the same thing. The county's public health officer extended the order, but many county commissioners were clearly unhappy about it. This, this is not right. It's a circular argument. The task force was not put in place to, to define or to, to decide a date that we're supposed to open. The, 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 the doctor has decided what that date is. And I've got a concern that the economy is not being factored into this decision. Many Johnson County business owners are voicing some of these same frustrations. KCTV5's Abby Dodge spoke to a number of them. She's live tonight now in Overland Park. Abby. Businesses are expressing deep disappointment with these decisions that have been made after hearing that their businesses are going to be closed for yet another week. We talked to one local business owner who says that's not going to work for her. Come Monday, her business will be open. Frustration, tears and detriment. All emotions Olathe business owner Rebecca Shipley felt after hearing the Johnson County Commission extended its stay at home order. It's a problem and, and I feel that my freedom and liberty and the opportunity I have to make my own way is being threatened and I can't believe it's happening in this nation. Rebecca says she's built barriers at the checkout stand, torn down walls and added arrows on the floor to comply with social distancing. Just to be told she can't operate until after Mother's Day. But I cannot survive unless I start to open. So she's taking her chances. I don't want anyone in here that doesn't want to be here. But your doors are open for people that do want to. Yes, ma'am. Rebecca says that she's lost about 90% of her sales over the last six weeks. And with Mother's Day coming up next Sunday, she didn't want to lose those sales too. Live in Overland Park, Abby Dodge, KC TV5 News.